Hello, my fellow adventurers! This is Maluncha, and welcome back to New World. In the previous episodes, we went over the initiate quests for the different factions quests that are now kind of left open for us, because we cannot join them, because there's a two-month waiting period to actually change factions. And as we are already... Well, let me go to character. If we're Well, we're already a part of the syndicate. The only quest line that we might actually be able to continue is the Syndicate one. And for that one, we are here today with Aventus Valen Valenti, I think it's called. Let's see what he has to say. Please, please come. <laughs> you look well equipped. And the Syndicate could pay you for your time. I see that you are new to the island. Aid me and perhaps I can shine some light on the darkness. You offer knowledge? Yes, and the most valuable kind, indeed, if you assist. You see, I've been testing alchemical lures on the local wolves. Results were promising, until one of the wolves consumed the bait and grew in both size and ferocity. <laughs> you were surprised the wolf ate your bait? I, well, expected that possibility, but not the precise nature of the reaction. We must annihilate the creature. Place this lure in their den and fight until the Alpha appears. Slay it, then meet me in the Enclave for your reward. Okay, let's uh, accept it. So, he placed a, uh, a bait. Uh, he ate it and turned into an Alpha Wolf. And now we're going to need to place a bait so we can make a second Alpha Wolf. <laughs> kind of sounds not correct right we need to go to the midnight den which is actually right next to us 206 meters it says prepare for battle and place the lure in midnight den call the alpha wolf and pack okay it doesn't seem that we need to kill these wolves on the outside so it's probably gonna be just running inside of the cave itself before we can actually do this quest of this this opening here it's not really a cave i think or is it a cave 64 meters 48 meters yeah it is a cave okay so we're gonna need to go in here and place the lure and kill these two first and let's skin these what happens now Starving wolves, okay. So now a bunch of wolves are probably gonna like keep rushing in. Interesting. Pickle fusion fangle wolf fully. Fanged fully. Okay. We got some saltpeter here as well. We're not gonna be able to take it before he actually hits us. Damn starving wolf. Thirty seconds remaining. Okay, While well, we're here, right? Silver my veins. Silver. Actually, a lot of ore from one. Oh, aggressive alpha wolf. There we go. And seems we cannot skin him. We do have a supply stockpile here. Travel northeast to the enclave. Speak with Aventus at the enclave. So, last enclave to actually visit is here at the fast travel point. I'm gonna walk there and actually show you what it looks like. And this is actually pretty cool. The syndicate enclave is actually inside... Uh, syndicate enclave is actually inside of a cave. <laughs> it's actually... It's actually pretty cool. And it looks amazing from the inside. It really does look amazing. Like, just look at this place, guys. Wouldn't you wish that this was a hub where everybody from the Syndicate would actually group up or actually have a reason to come to? <laughs> Thank you for helping to resolve those... Uh, <laughs> unexpected consequences. We do important work here. Studying Azos applications. But it is not without risks. Oh, yeah, uh, okay. Please come in. If you would, introduce yourself to Cleo. Okay, and where is Cleo? Additionally, where is Cleo? 
Be on top. Where the hell is Cleo? 40 meters away. She over here. The an alchemy station over here would be really nice. If we got a vendor over here. Fasty. Could I interest you with the latest homebrew? I'm getting few reports of ill effects this time. <laughs> few reports of ill effects. All right. Acquaintance of Aventus. His enthusiasm for research is admirable, but it creates complications from time to time. So I heard. He must make friends regularly. The Syndicate values those who help him uncomplicate his results. Tell me more about the Syndicate. The Syndicate. Scholars, arcanists, inventors, explorers of every kind. Yeah, I'm kind this of an explorer. This land suits the intellectually curious. Those who can handle a measure of danger, doubly so. You are welcome here. Return to Aventus. Okay. I, I, I really wonder... Once we actually are, like, linked to this place, if we can find some vendors that will actually sell stuff. After that mishap with the wolves, I must return to experimenting and trying anew. A different formula, or perhaps a new approach. Fortunately, research is what this place was built for. What I am built for. The facilities are impressive. Oh, you like them? If you join us in the Syndicate, they will be yours to use. Uh, should you be interested, I would like to test your mind as well as your body. Okay, bring it on, I would say. Azoth, the mysterious element that runs deep in this land. It is like nothing I ever experienced in the old world. Its potential applications are vast. Our very enclave itself is built near something quite special. Special and dangerous? Oh, you're sharp. No progress comes without danger. <clears throat> uh, take this bottle. Uh, mind the cliffs. Follow the path into Brightwood. Go through the grove and then to the moat. You haven't told me what I'm looking for. Consider that part of your test. You will know it when you see it. Oh, um... Mm. One more thing. Do not anger the creatures there. You will find that discretion can often serve you far better than brute force. A knowledge seeker hat. Dexterity intelligence with luck on it. An angry earth ward. Okay. So what are we gonna need to do? Collect the Azoth infused water. Okay. So it's the next to the Azoth tree that we have here. There's like three locations, if I remember correctly. And we can actually get that water. And I believe we can actually go through here. Would make no sense if they actually made like a pathway here and that you had to run around. Let's take the pathway they constructed for us. Yeah, that looks really cool. Like, really, really cool. Yep. Um, up we go. Come on. I wonder if we can get back out through here. Because it says don't, like, interrupt the creatures there. So we're gonna need to, like, sneak in. I presume. Yeah, it does seem like we can get back out through here. Oh. And it does seem we can. Oh yeah, there made it. Oh, that's a lot of Azoth pools. I don't remember there being so many here. And yeah, it's only one. All right, let's uh, head back and just skip over this dude if he would leave us alone. Come on, don't shoot your bow at me. There we go. Really nice. Oh, now you've seen the Azoth tree. It was truly beautiful, no? <laughs> well worth a little danger. Yes. Welcome to Eternum, my friend. Uh, you will have infinite time to take it in. 
The tree was certainly a marvel. Oh, I hoped you would see its true beauty. Uh, now, if I may have the infused water, <laughs> here is your payment. Hmm. You would make a marvelous member of the syndicate. However, you must first see an additional member of our order. Okay, and who would you want me to see? Cleo has already requested a word. If you came back in one piece, um, I see <laughs> he says mumbling. Please go and speak with her. I am willing oh, to prove myself. I believe you are. Go to her and keep an open mind. The task she has prepared may challenge you in more ways than one. Kind of sounds sexual. <laughs> I do have to be honest. So, Cleo. What do you got for me? You're looking fasty. Could I interest you with the latest homebrew? I'm getting few reports of ill effects this time. Wait, what? Wasn't he the NPC that was on the left side a second ago? Wasn't it this dude? I was like, Cleo is a woman, right? Ah, uh, a moment if you please. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you for speaking with me. Aventus has had much to say about you. Our order eagerly accepts capable candidates, and I hoped you would perform one final test to join our ranks. Shall we? Of course. Let's uh, complete it. The impermanence of death presents a peculiar conundrum when dealing with our adversaries. Let me ask you, how do you kill that which has no life? Well, we of the Syndicate aim to solve that. New problems do require new solutions. Indeed. This is an Azoth-infused sleeping draught with which I hope to subdue our immortal foes. Pour it into the wells at Broken Hull Hold and destroy their reserves to force them to drink it. So how does sleeping solve the problem? Lost who sleep do not fight. If they do not fight, they do not die. Those who do not die do not resurrect. The old world likened death to slumber. We are going to turn that metaphor into reality. Okay, and we get a musket, dexterity intellect with keen and vorpal. Again, these these quest rewards are actually pretty cool. Like thinking that these quests are like level 17. I'm not really sure what level you need to be. Required level 21 for this weapon. So it is a good advanced weapon that you can get while leveling up, right? Like a really good advanced weapon. Except the quest, and uh, let's see where we need to go. 518 meters away we need to go right next to the fast travel point so that's pretty easy and put the drought into the southern well travel southeast to broken hull hold and destroy the water bell reserves take water skins from the lost where is the fast travel point here over here and let's take this one to save a little bit of time seems like it's a uh, Tiny old castle, broken down castle. Long shadow pistoliers. He did drop something. Water skins, yeah. So we do need to pick up water skins. Break the water barrel. Okay, so we're hitting it this time. We've been uh kicking a lot of stuff recently. Pour the draught in the well. Check. And there's more water barrels here. Oh, they're actually like attacking me because I am attacking their water barrels. That's pretty interesting. Let's pick up these water skins and we need four more. Four more skills that we need. That's another water bottle. That's a water bottle. Got a provision crate here. Pick that up. I have a feeling we probably need to go up somewhere. Sentry. Pistolier. Wait, he didn't drop anything? The game didn't even register that I kill him. Strange. And the game registered that I killed him. Got another shaman here. Water skin, supply crate, one more water skin. 
And then we need the northern well. That's probably going to be on top here. Entry. There we go. It didn't drop anything. Long Shoto Plank Splitter. Let's leave him for last. Seriously? Where is this? Where is this will? A water skin? Where is the other well? 68 meters? Didn't we just use that well over there? Is the southern well and the northern well the same? Doesn't look like it. Where the hell is the Oh, it's uh it's not in this village, it's in the next one. Okay. So the enclave is a little bit bigger than I was anticipating. Where is this well? Let's see if we can do it without pulling anything. Uh, I just... Did I just pull a lever? Alright, return to Syndicate Enclave. Pretty straightforward. Understand these worlds. Your potential. You think you've seen much with this Syndicate. I will show you so much more. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's, uh... Let's see if we can actually join the Syndicate while we are a part of the Syndicate. And if there's actually follow-up quests, right? You return victorious. Yes. You are truly committed to the application of knowledge, and not just its pursuit. Despite how you may feel about the act itself, do know that this work will help the people of Everfall. Oh, I hope you're right. As do I. If I am not, we will simply try something else. Should you wish, we would be honored to have you join our ranks. Speak to Astrid when you're ready. She can begin your initiation. Alright, moment of truth, guys. Moment of truth. Where is Astrid? Seriously, where is, where, where is Astrid? It is possible that we do not have this quest. Astrid? Everything is in motion now. I need to fix her, and that means you. Or perhaps you seek assignment to even greater conflict. And yes, it seems we do not have a follow-up quest because we already are a part of this faction. So we do get the faction board here. It seems nothing kind of reset our reputation or the amount of tokens that we had. Uh, we still have the rewards. And this is kind of what I mean, right? It would be nice that the... Um, Syndicate's NPCs that we have in every settlement would still give these missions that are for the uh, well, the daily bonuses and the territory that comes the territory uh, bonuses that come along with it. And you basically need to do these PvP missions to actually like go into war. But it would be really nice if the reward system was no longer a part of these NPCs, but the reward system was only able to access through the enclaves. And that way, there was actually a means to come to these enclaves. Because now, for what I can see, I'm gonna take a little run around. I... I am glad you joined us. Never forget the way you reacted when I fired that one round. Okay, so... Yeah, let's quickly go over the NPCs. Let's see... Red softly... Red softly. Abayomi? You're back. <laughs> she said you'd be back. Okay. Red softly. So so far, I don't see any reason to come back to these enclaves, guys. That is really, really not good. Eh, people call me a scoundrel, but I haven't been this happy in ages. Uh, do you know anyone that needs their pockets picked? Uh, temple scouted? A house robbed? Give me all her. So the syndicate is not uh, is applying now with thieves and burglars? Okay. 
good to, uh, good to know that I'm a part of that as well. And we got another watchman here. Another watchman. You're looking fasty. Yeah, he, he doesn't have in any inventory. I'm getting arcane repository Isn't tier two, so there is an arcane repository here. But I don't think you can actually level it up. Uh, that's another arcane repository. There's no flowers to interact with, so it would be nice, like certain flowers that you can actually like pick up like once a day from this place. If you like needed specific flowers, would be a good means to actually be able to get your hands on them, maybe. But other than that, there is no reason to thing here. I want to make sure that I didn't miss anything. Fresh water. Yeah, there's no reason. That this sanctum might not be here if not for your efforts across Eternum. It may be hard to see at times, but even the tiniest actions help in the face of untold suffering. Thank you, friend. Yeah, maybe like in in the future, maybe re like repeatable quests that you could pick up here to actually increase your syndicate level and increase this base that would allow you to for instance a merchant that would actually sell certain items that you could only get while you were uh in the syndicate or while you were in the covenant or like just anything uh that actually we do have a kitchen tier here maybe get a kitchen watchman but softly like get a kitchen to level five in this place maybe the arcane repository to level five Maybe get the perks up that eventually you would see a storage chest over here. Like, give this place a meaning other than actually for the initiate quests. Because else there is no reason whatsoever you will ever return to this place. And these places look amazing. They need to have a reason to actually come here. Anyway, guys, we are going to end this episode up here. Let's sit the rest down and get nice and cozy and close by. If you want to see more of my Let's Play here in New World or any other game I might play. People are coming here and yeah, checking out if they can actually do something here. Uh, but yeah, if you, uh, <laughs> if you want to see more of my Let's Play here in New World or any other game I might play on my channel, just hit that subscribe button. It would always help out a lot. Do hope you, you enjoyed this episode and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.